That was our first, that was $9,564. It was our first almost $10,000 deal ever. And we never and made more a, than- It was a font deal. I'm gonna save you a bunch of time. If the names Lucida, Career New, don't mean anything to you, go ahead and close this page. <laughs> <laughs> You're smiling years you later. You see, That's my hilarious. friend, today we're reaching out only to the community of people known as font fanboys. <laughs> you know who you are. <laughs> if your knees go weak when I whisper Geraman, you might be one of them. You can call yourself a designer or developer to normal society, but behind closed doors, we know the elegance of Verdanus. <laughs> Verdanus. Ver 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 I'm going to finish it. Curves turn you on. And that's why we're here today. As Steve Jobs described his obsession with beautiful topography, quote, I learned about serif and sans serif typeface. I don't know why I'm doing British. About very... <laughs> <laughs> and he talks more about Steve Jobs' quote. If like Jobs, your lust for fonts <laughs> craves more and <laughs> more every month, the solution stands before you. Kernest. Did you hear that? I said Kernest. It takes an obsessive eye to pick which fonts play well together. And every month, a new combination of fonts are delivered to you. Complete with HTML and CSS highlighting. <laughs> That's some good copy. <laughs> Maybe you're like me. You can easily tell when something looks really good, but you don't know why. This is a problem I have. I can see clean looking web pages, but can't tell well my Frankensight doesn't look <laughs> as <laughs> slick. <laughs> Often the answer is topography. When I smash Arial 12 <laughs> just, <laughs> with a Tahoma 36, it somehow doesn't work <laughs> and don't even get me started on the color schemes. Once again, Curtis to the rescue. When you get your new fonts, you can rejoice that you don't have to fool around with them. They are ready to implement and the grueling process of marrying fonts together has been taken care of by the almighty Kernest himself. <laughs> most things in life aren't free and don't dare expect Kernest to be. Kernest charges 15 bucks a month for delivering the most obsessively picked font combinations every month. This, my dear Sumaling, is $180 a year. A fair price for making your client's knees quiver <laughs> when they see your stunning work. But full price makes the app sumo angry and hungry. <laughs> <laughs> that was the first character reference. <laughs> this is where you started. He came alive. We have convinced with a K, <laughs> Kernest with a K through, in <laughs> through intimidation <laughs> and force <laughs> to give away a lifetime membership at less than a yearly price. This means no monthly payments, no yearly <laughs> Oh my god. No yearly payments, no alimony payments. <laughs> 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 Dude, this is so good. No nothing for life. Just magical font combinations every month capable of making an ugly project come to life from beautiful topography. As you know from past Upsuma promotions, we always get the late to the gamers whining and pleading to let them buy the deal after it's over. The countdown on Upsuma does not lie. If you are a designer, take action now to stand out from the lifeless design and stay ahead of the game. Get your lifetime membership to Kernest here. P.S. We also convinced, aka threatened Kernis, to give away the last four months of font combinations for every lifetime sign up through this deal. You get them as soon as you sign up. Period. That was good. That was like. No, it was not. You know, because before, literally, I had a guy in Bulgaria, Nikolai, who I love. He would write the emails, and he doesn't even speak English really well. <laughs> and he'd be like, here's the deal, and uh, you get the link. Soviet and then you... Russia font by you. <laughs> yeah. So it, the point of the article was not to be funny. The point was to sell. Like that was the number one overall. And then funny was just a bonus. Cause not all of them were funny. There was a couple of ones that were like really serious and stuff. So when you're selling someone, there's like three types of people. There's like the ones who are gonna buy no matter what. Mm -hmm. The ones who are like, not, they're just like uh, the tire kickers. Mm -hmm. It's that middle fence that like this copy is actually really appealing to, right? Yeah. It's the ones who are like, I don't really know, convince me. Right, people actually, it's like when you go to a restaurant, you're like, what should I order? They're like, well, this is actually, what, do you like chicken? Oh, this dish is like the best one we've ever had. 